So how have you seen open education affect student success and the overall OU experience? So students, when course materials are more readily available, when they're more affordable, when they're free, uh, students breathe a sigh of relief and they don't just tell the faculty that, though they tell the faculty that all the time. So faculty who use uh, open educational resources and also participate in the creation of those resources uh, receive very positive feedback from students for their efforts on those students' behalf. But students also talk to us in the college. So we have dozens and dozens of stories from students who feel their educational experience has been improved, but also from students who feel their ability to stay in college, to stay enrolled in their particular degree program, has been enhanced by the efforts of faculty to participate in both the creation of those materials and making those materials more readily available. So it enhances the student experience in no small part by reducing the anxiety that students experience when they cannot afford materials that are required for classes. So I would urge uh, faculty in the college to, to follow the example of those faculty who've already played a central role in creating uh, course modules and at times entire uh, textbooks for students. The College of Arts and Sciences is here to help uh, and support uh, those efforts. We feel that uh, the, the work involved in creating these materials is uh, it's hugely time intensive. Uh, so the college wants to support faculty in being able to invest that time um, in, in the initiatives uh, because the feedback that we get from students is so positive. Every semester, hundreds of thousands of dollars are saved for students across the university as a whole, uh, but for individual students, it can be hundreds of dollars every single semester that they're at the university. And that can be the critical difference in uh, their uh, financial capacity, uh, which is a huge factor in their ability to, to succeed.